Hey everyone, it's CR7 here with another diecast review, and this one's pretty exciting because today we're going to be reviewing Austin Cindric's 2022 discount tire car in the 124 scale, my first 124 scale diecast. And this rookie of the year thing's just a display thing, there's the original box. Now the thing is with the next gen boxes, they're kind of different as opposed to the older ones. I'll show Ryan Newman's uh, Coke Industries car from 2020. For example, it has this little cover on it as opposed to this, which they did kind of like an arrow thing with it. So anyways, I do have a screwdriver here to get this out with. So we're gonna go ahead and take the car out of the box to not keep the, uh, the viewers waiting. There we go, I'm gonna pull out, pull it out. I'll show you how this uh, slides out here. Here, take the cover off. I'll just, uh, Put everything to the side. Take the car off the base. This might take a little while, as opposed to my other two 124 scale reviews, which is which were the Harvick and uh, Martin Ducars from 2007. And I just realized that the screwdriver is way too darn big. Um, just a moment, everyone, while I go get another. Oh wait, hold on. Found another one. <laughs> I was gonna just about to cut the video to uh, grab a smaller screwdriver. All right, so this might take a while. This might make the video's uh, runtime a bit longer than anticipated, but it is what it is. There we go. Got the first screw off. Now I gotta get the second screw off. I'm using a tiny uh, flathead screwdriver and the screws are usually Phillips head screws. All right, I do believe I got it loose from the stand. Yep, I do. The stand is now off. All right, let me put that uh, screwdriver over there. So yeah, let's get on with the diecast review, starting with the car rolling off screen, if I can roll it. Rolls uh, pretty good. Now this, this tire might be a little uh, stopped up, but anyways, we're gonna get on with the review. <laughs> See if I can hold this on frame. Now, this is the next gen car. I've been waiting to get one of these. And the first one is a Ford. So, we're gonna get on to the review starting with the front. Here is the front. <laughs> now, the Ford logos, everything looks in place right here. Sunoco logos right there. This one's a bit misplaced. But, anyways, here's the passenger side. The wheels are opposable, as you can see right here. And here's the forward exhaust pipe as well as this they had to change it it was this was originally supposed to be in the back anyways that's the, that's the point that's the discount tire logo number two cup series there's a bit of a line on this windshield here i don't know if you can make that out there yeah right there i'm not sure if that's a crack if it is that's kind of unfortunate anyways uh here's the big <laughs> rims here the uh, rims Chrome rims here is the back of the car. Discount car, let's get you taken care of. And you can see the, I think the spoiler is slightly plastic, but metal. It feels, it feels metal to me. Anyways, uh, here is the rear diffuser. Rookie stripes, cause Cindric's a rookie. He did win the day 2500. <laughs> so yeah, here is the, Driver's side with the window net here. Uh, looks pretty cool. Number two, discount tire, NASCAR Cup Series. And here is the hood. Uh, the wheels are posable, as you can see. We're gonna try to get the hood open. Here it is. Here is the hood detail. Not impressive to some people, but uh, I think it's all right. So yeah, that, there's the hood intakes. The hood vents don't really stand out from the car but eh, it is what it is so close the hood the roof flaps also deploy as you can see these keep the car from going flying to space yeah <laughs> so this is just a normal arc car this is not the elite here's the undercarriage feels plasticky now on the elite cars you can take the underbelly off you can see the uh 
all the inner workings but no exhaust pipes kind of a spoiler alert because it would get in the way of this screw here i guess here the underwing looks just it's just a big blob of plastic <laughs> so you can notice the onboard cameras there here the spoiler kind of brings out the, the coolness and the lowness of the next gen cars anyways I'm loving the next gen die cast in the 124 scale. They also had the Kevin Harvick Hunt Brothers car in this scale, but I decided to get Cindric because he's our Daytona 500 winner this year. And the car looks pretty nice. I really like it. So anyways, this has been a review on Austin Cindric's 2022 discount tire next gen car. So yeah, subscribe for more die cast reviews and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.